They may not know this, but uh, I am a sort of a secret admirer of people of the desert. Because uh, although uh, other people around the, the world have it difficult because of their climatic environment and uh, their surroundings and the topography, they manage to survive, they manage to develop a life, life for themselves that is deemed worthy and appropriate and efficient for their particular kind of lifestyle. And they prefer, either prefer to be that way and continue in that way of existence or that is just all they know. Because that's how they were raised. Uh, they've heard rumors about what it's like in other parts of the world, but, uh, and then some of them may even have aspirations to, to visit those areas. But uh, many do not have the resources, uh, financial restraints, uh, legal conditions, uh, being able to get a passport and be approved to leave the country. A lot of governments are very restrictive on who gets to travel and who doesn't get to travel. It's just, uh, it's the way it is. Some governments are more stringent and oppressive than others. But here in my country, in, in the United States of America, we allow people to freely do things as, within a certain, uh, you know, certain parameters, uh, not without with still respecting laws, but our laws are not oppressive, they're not restrictive. We maintain the do good to other people uh, as you would have them do to you. Uh, that's our laws here in America. We don't try to infringe on people's uh, abilities to purchase property, to have recreational time, as long as it is good for society and good for the environment and good for it brings honor to the country and to its citizens and to individuals. Uh, we're not too stringent over here. We love freedoms. And uh, freedoms are good as long as they're not abused or taken advantage of. We can all prosper together. We all have access to health care. We all have access to, to the possibility of obtaining and wealth and investments and all that good stuff that we can pass down to our children, to the next generation, so that they can have success and prosper before God Almighty.